A taxidermist preserves a family's cherished golden retriever's fur, stating that the memento will never be used as a rug. A golden retriever's memorial for his mourning family was created. Pet preservation, according to Maddie of Chimera Taxidermy, has become increasingly popular. She added that although her pieces are displayed, they are never utilized as floor coverings. Show us some love! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe! When a family's cherished pet dog passed away, they made the unique choice to make its fur into a souvenir, which sparked discussion among viewers over whether it went a little too far. Melbourne-based Chimera Taxidermy posted a video of the Golden Retriever spelt on social media with the caption, This will be treasured as a memento by his family. Maddie, the 29-year-old owner of the company, claimed that the pelt was tanned and made into leather, so the fur won't fall out, and should last for many years. On Friday, Maddie published a follow-up stating that, contrary to what some people believed, the pelts are not used as carpets to walk on but rather kept stored away or displayed. I didn't turn this golden retriever into a rug for the living room. For people who wish to maintain a tangible memento of their pet, I design alternative pet memorials, she said. Some people pick just a portion of the pelt, while others pick the whole thing. The animals I keep are not carpets. They are kept with owner's ashes, mementos, artwork, collars, and other keepsakes. The idea is the same as keeping an urn on a shelf. Many commenters expressed support and stated she was assisting individuals in dealing with the loss of a cherished animal. One participant commented, I don't think people realize how unique this art is and how much peace it can give. Another person remarked, Love to you and the owners who find comfort in your services. A third responded, I would much rather have a pelt or taxidermy than ashes. Others, however, claimed that such a reminder would be challenging for them. One person remarked, My memories give me calm. I couldn't do this. It would make it tougher for me. Another person remarked, This is interesting, but definitely not for everyone. A third said, I don't know if I would be able to bear seeing this. Since she was 18 years old, Maddie has been creating pet taxidermy, which has become increasingly popular in recent years, she told Yahoo News Australia. Some of them serve as a nostalgic keepsakes, while others are displayed laying on beds or in other ways that their owners desire to keep them safe, she said. She claimed that most of her requests are for complete taxidermy mounts, and she has also done work on canines, cats, bunnies, and birds. While costs are quoted for each job individually, owners may need to budget anywhere from a few hundred to a few thousand dollars to maintain their pet. Helping individuals through their grief and enabling them to have a piece of their pet for all time is rewarding, according to Maddie. We found this all very interesting. Please do let us know what are your thoughts on this in the comments.